Alrighty, so we're on to the Chopper Canada 400 at Chicago Land Speedway. A look at the points. Dale Jr., Dale Jarrett, Gordon Burton, and Bobby Labonte are top five in points at the moment. Uh, so if you missed the last couple videos, with our new sponsor, we basically have to finish or get into the top 30 in points and start knocking out good runs. Um, so here's Tom, here's, well, here's 30th, uh, Johnny Benson, he's got, uh, 1,421 points. Now we scroll down here, we are up to 36th, uh, with 11.05. So, we've got a little ways to Benson, but, uh, if we keep on knocking out, you know, top 30s, I feel like we can get there eventually, but, uh, yeah, we, uh, <laughs> I hate to say it, but we might have to result to... To, to loop in a couple people for some cautions because once again if if we don't get to that top 30 in points the rest like our our just sponsor salary is not very good it is not good whatsoever so at some point if we don't put up results then well, we're gonna suck ass so we're, we're gonna start losing money and then we're gonna start not being able to put components back together and it's just gonna be a tough road from there so Again, it all, it all comes back to my. But if we if we do make it to the top thirty, if we do make it to the top thirty, uh, and we you know qualify a thirtieth or better and finish thirtieth or better, then all we got to do is get one of those bonuses, and then we'll be we'll be on from there. All right, so we're gonna bring pretty much the best stuff to Chicago, and uh, hope we can uh, you know finish top thirty. So fifty-seven engine power, uh, a good chassis, and our body with fifty-eight down for us. So. Hope it's enough. All right, well, I have to qualify. I don't think we have uh, quite the speed. I'm sad to say, I'm not really sure. We're definitely, uh, we're definitely gonna see, uh, you know, this is gonna be, this is gonna tell where we're at. Although we hooked it up pretty good there. I'm afraid I've got it set up too loose for the race, but I'm gonna try it. This track is really tight. It's hard to get to turn in. And turn four is pretty tricky because you really want to shove off turn four, so. I don't know, man. Money lap. It actually felt better than I thought it would right there, so. There we go. Let's get it. Oh, man. We actually turned it right there, and I even weak sauced it. I didn't think I'd be able to get it to turn that good. Okay. We're not going to wuss out in turn three. There we go. I think this actually might be a pretty solid lap. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Come on, show it to me. Oh, hey. Whew. All right, 21st. I didn't think we had it in us. God, I hope it's not too loose for the race, man. The NASCAR Winston Cup Series comes to Illinois this week for today's race, the Tropicana 400 at the Chicago Land Speedway. Barney, we're still kind of new to this place. What do you think so far? Well, Joe, this really is a state-of-the-art facility. It's a one-and-a-half-mile trial, well, similar to Las Vegas with more banking. We're in for a great race today. Dale Earnhardt Jr. is our NASCAR Winston Cup Dale points Earnhardt leader Jr. coming into this race. What a great feeling that must be to have the points lead. Although you also have to think about the guys closing in behind you, one bad day at the track, and you got to start climbing the ladder all over again. Bobby Labonte has had a run of impressive finishes at the Speedways this season. You know, I watched him in practice, and that car just looks good. Sometimes you can just tell by watching the car on the track who's going to be fast on race day without even looking at the speed charts. The Nabisco Chevrolet has had some bad luck the last two races. I believe they've got a good chance to turn their luck around right here. These guys have been working extra hard this week, and I think it just may pay off for them in the end. Okie dokie. Here we go. Here's the starting Jimmy line. Johnson, Jeff Gordon, front row. Man, I hope we don't suck. I'm afraid we're just going to go straight backwards once we get going. But I don't know, man. I definitely think we got enough speed to finish top 30. So, Lord help me, man. Lord help me. All right. So, Bobby Labonte's pissed. Who else was pissed from Daytona? Ashton Lewis? Oh, boy. Well, here we go. Oh, yeah. There's Joe Nemechek. We want to finish better than him. Oh boy, I, I'm already a little concerned. Oh yeah. As long as we get up to speed here. And we hit our line. Oh man. Oh, look out. Okay, that's stuck. That's stuck for now. 
Now all it has to do is do that for the entire race. If it could do that the entire race, I could finish 23rd, I think. I could finish top 30, we'll put it that way. Oh man, this is tricky. I'm scared, man, I'm scared. I don't like this track, I don't, I don't know, I just don't feel very confident here. Easy. There we go. Right past Mike Skinner. Go back here where you belong, Mike. Here we come. We gotta run on Jerry. As soon as we pull out, man, just like NASCAR E2, we stall. Hey, we sort of kind of gotta run. Oh shit. Oh, I knew I wasn't gonna stick that. It's hard. It's so hard to pass on the entry of the corner for me. It really is, I'll tell you that. Yeah, because of that, we're gonna give up a spot to Bill Elliott. Yeah, I'm just worried. See how I did that right there? It's already like lap three, kind of skidding a little bit. Oh, I don't know. I want that. But I really had to loosen it up because it was not good in practice. Yeah, there you go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I don't like that. Oh, I don't like that. I mean, we can always tighten it up, but I don't want to go this whole first run and just suck balls because we start doing that so damn early. Damn, Jerry could just stick that shit, man. Gah. I almost overdrove the corner and put it in the wall. Yeah, there we go. Now we start falling back. Start getting run over on both sides. Oh, man. I really wish we didn't have to do this. It's so tight right there in the answer. I got to smash the brakes there, pump them there for a second to get the set the nose. We were holding our own, but... It, uh, just got an angry group behind me. They always do this, man. They always do this. Seven, eight laps in the run, and they just, like, pile up behind me and just wait for me to make my one mistake, and then I get freight trained by, like, nine spots. Oh, I hate it. I hate it with a passion, man. I just want to drive away. Just, just like, once. Like, what? you can't tell me all these guys are just going to be that, that much quicker. Not one of them is going to fall back. Somebody's got to have a bad race. All right, fine. Well, there's one. Yeah, there's two. All down the straightaway. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. So it begins. So it fucking begins. I'm going to get pissed off. I'm going to turn somebody. I'm calling it. Pisses me off, man. I just want to run good. I got the components to run good. I mean, we're still running good, but oh, it does this shit every damn week. Oh shit! I about messed it up right there. And here we go, three wide, Johnny Benson. Oh my god! Oh, car sucks, donkey dick. It's like it does every week. Past ten laps. Yep. Well, this group is almost past. Yeah, two more cars. Joe, Kyle Petty. And it looks like we got some space there for a while. So, I guess, that, I guess that's promising. I don't know. We still have, what, about a half a run left? 24 laps, it looks like, so. Uh, there it is. There we go. In all reality, the car is really not that bad. I just get really anxious. They put me in a Dale Jr. car. I have pretty good components underneath of me. I just want to. I already won a race. Now I'm cocky and I want to. I want to win everything. I don't know. I'm just. I'm just so worried though. Like, this is probably the most worried I've been in my career. I don't want to ruin the second half of season two because I chose a sponsor and I can't get to the top 30 points. Because this, this whole deal is just centered around the sponsor bonus. And if I can't get that at any of the races, then I'm afraid we're going to go back to where we started with 50 all-around engine components and components, a chassis and body and everything. Hey, we're still, we're still, we're still working, man. Hitting our marks. And we're still running 30 at 15 laps in, so I'm pretty proud of that. I'll spot the Jeff Green. He 
just kicked it up another gear. Now he's on his way. And we got Kyle Petty, and then, yeah. I mean, look at the mini man, man. Look at the gap we've got on just about everybody behind us. It's really strung out, so that's what we needed, man. A good first run to get away from everybody, and then we can go from here. At the very worst, as long as we don't mess this up too badly, like we're running right here around top 30, so we can we can work with this really well. I tell you what's really been helping. My man Ricky Craven, just chilling in 30th, in when you're ready. and uh, we've been sucking that ass and sharing it with him. He ain't really doing anything with it, but he's definitely helping me. And I'm really proud of myself. I haven't stuffed it in the wall yet. I've been wanting to, I, I tell you that. Oh yeah, right there. Picked a good time for the right rear to hit, or the right front to hit red. Right there on that exit of the corner, yeah, I was using it up a lot there. Yeah, I'm going to be coming in here very, very soon, the next lap or two. So I've hit that final stage of cliff, and uh, the car has just gotten bad. Yeah, I need tires. So I'm coming to hell in. I've had enough of this. Yeah, I'm coming in. Sorry, Schrader. Everything okay with the car? There we go. All right, yeah, four tires of fuel. I uh, don't have any damage. That's good. All right, boys, big stop. Big stop. We need a clean stop. And hopefully, we can get out there and run a couple hot laps before everybody else comes down and gets tires and make up a little bit of ground. So. Oh, yeah, of course. Go figure. Yep. How much time is that going to lose? It's all kinds of time. One second, two second, three second. Yep, 21 second stop. Always appreciate it, guys. Thanks, thanks for your continued effort. God. Oh, now it doesn't fucking matter. There's my man Greg. Plus 50. How you doing? I think he's running last. I'll be honest with you. I think he's trying to pit. I think that's why he's riding so him close. It's, it appears that way. Oh, I'm gonna hit the wall. Ugh. There's Ashton Lewis. Running him. There's Jack. Even Grub. Yeah, as you can see, we lost quite a bit of time. There you go, up to 36th. It's not too bad. Should get a couple of more here. We went out there and ran a good couple of laps. So we should have cut into that time, I think, that we lost on pit road. It's Casey Mears. Oh, yeah. Couldn't quite get around him. Great. The 41 car is still there. Uh, got one on pit road with an issue. It's like Rusty Wallace. That put us up in the 33rd. That's definitely a big spot. And here comes Kevin Harvick. To lap me? Yeah. It should have took him a lot longer. Uh, a little bit longer. Still, that's, that's just horse shit. Our, our left front tire changer, or our front tire changer messed that up. Definitely lost about three or four seconds of that, so. Whatever. We well, got one hit in pit road. Oh, we got a lot of cars on pit road. Okay, good to know. The 20 car is inside. It just worked out too perfect. I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. I blame I blame my front tire changer. We shouldn't have been that far back. We were running pretty solid there, right around 30, 31st. We were about ready to make our pit stop, but apologies to Tony Stewart, but he didn't deserve that. Oh, but that's going to help, man. That's going to help out a lot. All right, tire changers. Can you guys do it this time? I don't want to ask for much, man. I really don't. Oh, man. I didn't realize we got Fig Newtons on the dick lid. Hell yeah. I do love me some Fig Newtons. All right. Hey, we got rid of the donuts on the side. Or did they come back? I don't know what the hell happened. Okay. Well, that's everybody's final pit stop.
I mean, see, Tony Stewart came out seventh. That's, that's, that's pretty good for him. Yeah. And lap down in 34th. So that might not even help. I don't think it trapped. Uh, yeah, it didn't really trap anybody. Yeah. Guess he didn't do it. Uh, did it a little bit too early. Oh well. I was ready for a break anyways, or at least this bunches us back up. I was hoping I'd be able to trap a lot of those guys, but I'm not really too worried about it. I don't know who pit and who didn't, but um, that's okay. At least we can, uh, we should be able to race it, race it out with some of these guys up here. I still think we got a pretty fast car, but uh, yeah, we're going all the way in now, so. Man, right up that ass, Casey. Yeah, three wide. Come on, I want these spots. Short way around. Come on. Come on. All right. Casey Mears got better straightaway speed than I do. We gotta use him to turn. There we go. We actually sort of kind of bounced off him. That helps. Come on, Tony. I need that push. Oh, Tony's pissed. Yeah, I wonder why. There we go. We stuck it. All right. We gone. Very nice. I'd like to see him. Oh, hey, Tony Stewart didn't even hit me. So we're all right. He understands. I hate that. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I can't fucking get off him, man. It's so balls tight going off into the corner. So balls tight. And then I get stuck on him and I can't turn either. God bless America. Have mercy on my soul. Fucking shit. Yes, I like to pit under fucking caution. God bless America, man. I went all of our components. Fucking. Fucking fuck. Car is fucking killed. Jesus Christ, this just got worse, man. I guess that's kind of karma. That's what I get for turning Tony Stewart, but. I just hate that, man. It doesn't turn anyways, and once they get stuck on him, it just keeps on going right up the track. I try, man. Jeez, we, we had good components, we weren't that fast. Our pit crew fucked it up. I, I wanted to turn somebody to hopefully get some spots back and get it back to where we could race for it. And then we did that. We just, we, we can't fucking win, man. We can't. Ugh. That thing is fucking destroyed. Jesus. Well, it looks like at least the furthest back we can go is 37th, I think. I think. Oh my god, Ashton Lewis is, yeah, okay, so we did pin some guys. We got that going for us, I guess. Oh man, somebody's. I heard debris wobbling. Pieces, uh, pieces of cars wobbling. Can't tell if it's me or. What the hell are we stopping for? Jeez, there are a lot of cars wide right there. Oh boy. Oh my God, and they're uh, they're crashing. Oh my god! You're clear. Don't mind if I do. What the hell? Oh, please, can we end the race now? Please? Well, that definitely helped out a little bit. Sadly, I don't think we've got the speed to really do anything about it. I'm gonna try, though. Oh, that helps us. That helps us. Okay, stack is back up again. Yeah, I don't know. This, this race got weird. I don't know what the hell that was. I thought they were going to wreck not too far in front of us, but then they ended up crashing even farther ahead of us. So, yeah, hey, if we could just keep on going to Bree Cautions, we might be able to luck out here. We got to get a good finish. We have to get a good finish. So who is the debris from? Oh, man, somebody lost a hood, I think. Oh, it's Casey Mears. No, he lost his deck lid. Ha! Huh. You don't see that very often. That's pretty cool. Wow. He just lost a lot of downforce at right there. That would have been cool to see him spin. Yeah, I don't think we've seen that yet. That's pretty neat. Yeah, not pitting.
Nope, no pits from me. Lord help me. 29th. Oh man, and I'm getting run the hell over. So next car is Kenny Wallace, Kyle Petty. Just give me to turn one here. Give me to the back stretch. Then maybe turn three. Oh man. They don't have too many laps left, so we're a lap down. I'm telling you, man. Oh my God, and we got another one. All right, cool. Let's let's just end it. Let's just end it. I'd be okay with that. <laughs> I hate restarting, man. We're so damn slow. What is this? I racing? Oh man. Who was it this time? Terry Lavani, you're in a dead ass last. Losing his hood. I have some big chunks of debris too. Lost the deck lid, we lost the hood. <laughs> well that just flaps around. Oh boy, alright. Yep, not pitting. Alright, let's try it again. Well, so we're all starting single file this time around. What the hell happened? Jeez. Stacked everybody up. So Greg Biffle's next for position. And Kenny Wallace, I guess, Fittipaldi is for position, I think. I don't know. I just want to oh, I just want to finish this thing so bad. We're really not that slow. Even, like, with the damage. Yeah, fuck that up. Oh, and I'm going to hit the wall. No, I'm not. I got pretty lucky there. All right. There you go. There's the end of it. Three straight debris cautions. Unreal. All right, well, do I go for Fittipaldi or not? I don't think it's worth it. Nope, 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 nope. No count. Oh, fuck. All right, well, looks like it's going to be 31st then. Nope, I'm getting underneath them. I want my spot back. I want my spot back. I'm sorry, Kenny. I'm sorry. I'm an ass. I just want... Just top 30. Just top 30? God, we... That was a mess. I think that's the end of it. Please just end it, man. Just end it. 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 Yes! Hey, Ricky Rudd won. All right. Nice bounce back race for him. Oh, man. We destroyed the car, but we got a top 30 at the end of the day, so we really needed that. Oh, boy. I'm... How about all those caution laps they ran? Well, lots of cautions that was, that was, so was rough. A lot of... All right. Well, Tony Stewart's pissed. Yeah, understandable. It's okay. He's way faster than I am, so we won't see him very often. But, uh... What can we do, man? What can we do? We didn't gain or lose any money, so we're still right there at 60000 So, like, once again, I shoot you not. Unless I, like, luck into a really good finish, I basically have to scratch and claw. And, yes, wreck, my, wreck people every once in a while to get a, a decent finish. Because... Of my sponsor, only seventy-three thousand, thirty-three thousand uh, from the race winnings, which once again is not a lot, and we broke even. So <sighs> it's fucking tough, man. That is tough. We're going to New Hampshire. We might be able to rig something there, but I don't know, man. It's just tough. Ricky Rudd with a win. So see what happened. To everybody else behind us. So Rusty Wallace had problems. Uh, Hermie Sadler did, and Tony Stewart blew up at some point. And everybody else got pinned. Um, and yeah, we finished 30th, so. Ah, oh, man. Look at all the people one lap down. We could have finished uh, as high as 23rd, but uh, yeah, there you have it. Well, let's take a look at the uh, let's take a look at the points. See if we're anywhere close to the top 30. Uh, 35th. All right. So who's 30th? Ken Schrader. 1524. 1178, so. We gotta, we, we gotta run even better, man. We're like we're climbing, but towards 30, I think we lost ground. So, <laughs> fuck, man. Oh, it sucks. Take a look at the garage. One race left there. The new engine build is done. Thank the Lord. The new body build is done. Very nice. Wow, look at that. We killed the car and we're still at 54 or 55 down for us. Oh, that's that is fucking huge, man. Well, once again, yeah, I feel a little bit better now that we got that stuff done. 
I guess we're going to have to bring it to New Hampshire and once again kind of rig it and hopefully we finish like top 25, top 20 maybe. Honestly, if I get the chance like we had at Richmond where everybody told me to <laughs> turn somebody when I could have pinned everybody like a lap down and finished third, if we get a situation like that, I'm probably just going to have to take it. Like, I don't want to run like that. I know you guys don't want to just see me go out there and just turn people for good finishes every race. But, like, if you don't get it by now, we're, we're stuck in a hole because of the sponsor I took because I didn't think it through all the way. So it's my fault at the end of the day, but yeah we're just we're just bad if we can get top 30 in points though and we just get that bonus once then i'll be okay i'll be just fine but we got to get top 30 in points by the end of the season because eventually we're not making any money <laughs> so eventually once those components go away like we can't fix anything right now so we either have big finishes and gain money or we don't have big finishes and we end up waiting until the sponsor runs out when we get new sponsors on there so well, i hope you guys enjoyed today's video uh it was something i'll tell you that but uh it's definitely clear what we have to do moving forward so once again we got a new engine and we got to do body so we're gonna take all our prime best stuff once again to new hampshire and we're gonna try to hopefully earn some money but that'll do it appreciate you guys for watching as always i'll see you all in the next video